Hey, how you all doing out there in YouTube land? This stiletto coming at you from the Wild Wild West. Today, got another unboxing for you. Another unboxing for you. This one's coming from DLT Trading. DLT Trading. Here we go. Oh, doing the opening day is my new little buddy here. My little sidekick. My Launch 12. USA made launch 12 CPM 154 Blackstone watch blade no stiletto Let me see open it right here This is an awesome little knife <laughs> The little knives can be cool too This is perfect for doing stuff like this it does it better than the bigger knife. Okay. Invoice. Protec Calmigo. Black handle stone wash. Okay. DLT trading. Victor. Very cool. And there it is. Okay. Let's put all this stuff up here. Nice box. Now this is the second one I'm trying out. I just want to get a couple of them, just so, so I can compare them to one another. This is the first one. California Legal Auto. And this is by, by, made by ProTech. The best company, one of the best companies, American companies for autos. ProTech. Nice box. Oh, yeah, I like that. That's... <laughs> They got style. Always, the, always the, the high-end American companies always have a lot of style. Like Hug, they they do they do the exact same stuff. They have fancy boxes and nice pouches for their blades. Even though you never use none of this stuff, it does look good. You know, to collectors or people like me who appreciate all the nice packaging, Protex seal. Now this knife is going to stay out, so I'm going to put all this stuff neatly back in here. Because this knife is not going to be a safe queen. This knife is getting used. And we're going to check it out over this next year. These two. These two are the ones I'm checking out. Not getting any other little autos. These are the only ones I wanted to get. This one has a lock on it. Center it perfectly. Nice thick handle scales. That's what I'm showing you. Nice thick scales. Or, or, or handle frame, should I say. Oh, this one I can feel a little. I can I can tell where it, where it connects together too. It's not told this flush right here. A little I can tell a little bit there. Can't tell across here. So you know the quality in these so far is comparable. This one's a little bit smaller. The handle's smaller. Let me fold this one up so you guys. The launch is a, has a longer handle. The blades are about the same size though. I like this pocket clip. 
there's no billboarding on the pocket clip and with this black handle like this this would be to this would totally hide away in your pants let's see what it opens like it's nice oh yeah it's a nice little blade too this is a real usable looking blade And this one's 154 CM. This one has a little bit better steel. This has CPM 154. Let's do some measurements on these, compare them together. Now we got them both together, we can weigh them out and compare them weight wise too. I think these are the smallest knives I've ever had on my, my channel. <laughs> About five and three quarters. And this one's a little bit over five and a quarter. So this is about half an inch longer. The blades are the same though. I'm pretty sure the blades are the same. Let's check that out. Yeah, this one's just under two inches. And this should be just under two inches too. This one's actually closer to two inches. So this must be like a 1.99 or something. <laughs> it's almost two inches. I love it. This one feels heavier too. Let's weigh them. I'm going to do the Protec first. 2.2 ounces. The Kershaw, the Launch, 12. 1.9 ounces. This one has, I know because it's a little bit heavier, it just feels like a lot of quality. Protect four, number four. Oh, it's number. Let me see. Pro. It says PR four. It has a space, and it says number four eighty nine. So I wonder if this is the four hundred eighty ninth one that was produced. So it might be serial number. Stone wash blade. This side says Protec USA. These both have 6061 aluminum handles. Aircraft grade aluminum handles. So the materials in both of these are very similar. Even though this one has the powdered steel over the one the one that's not powdered, but it's still they're still both 154. This one in hand goes about two and a half fingers with, with me. So this one has a real little grip. Right about two and a half fingers. Let's see how they cut. Let's check out how well they cut. Protec will go first. Let's check out this edge. We're going to go from the choil all the way to the tip. Oh, okay, it's totally sharp. Totally sharp. Very nice edge. Okay, now let's check out the launch. From the troll to the tip. Oh, that's even nicer. The launch actually cuts nicer. <laughs> I 
Oh, wow, that's a really nice edge. <laughs> well, the launch is cheaper. This is this this was almost it was $127, $127 I think it was for this one. This one was 89. This one is probably a more conservative style where it wouldn't freak out anybody. I don't think this would freak out anybody anywhere at all. And with autos, if you don't want to use the, use the switchblade part of it, you can always put your finger like in front of the blade and slowly release it. So that way you're really not going to scare anybody. It would be totally okay, I think, to use this one in public. I don't think, I don't think anybody would freak out about this knife at all. At least, at least it doesn't freak me out. <laughs> but yeah, you can you can close it, you can open it and close it quietly too if you want to. Or you can have some fun. The action on this is really nice. It feels really this knife when you close it, it feels super smooth. You can feel the quality in it. Excellent knife. And it's got a fairly thick blade. That's what I'm showing you. This one's thick too. They're both thick blades for their size. I, I think they're really thick. They both look like three millimeter blades. And for a two inch blade, that's plenty. That's, that's, I would call that thick for a two inch blade, a three millimeter blade. But I really like this one. I think this is my favorite. I think I like the launch the best. I'm just keeping it real. You know me, I'm stiletto. So, you know, I, I, I may be a little bit prejudiced in this, in this choice. But, <laughs> but this one is really cool too, though. And this one looks like it'd be the better work knife because I don't think it would ever freak anybody out because it, even though this one is small, it's still a stiletto. And, you know, some people are about stiletto switchblades. This one just looks like a work knife. It just looks like a utility knife to me. And that blade... It'd probably be good for, you know, like hunting and, and, and uh, I don't know, the, the blade might be kind of small for a lot of things, but the blade shape itself, if it was a longer blade, it'd be a good skinning blade. It'd be good, good for dressing game and stuff like that. I think this one might be a little bit too small. This one's, this one's, you know, this one's probably going to open letters better because of the shape of the blade. So for a little tiny knife, it might be better to have a knife with more of a, a, a spear point blade or, or a dagger shape or a, a, a bayonet style blade. Because this is going to open letters very easily. Whereas this kind of, you know, blade point is going to be a little bit trickier to get under some envelopes, you know, to open them up. But they're both beautiful knives. And we're gonna, I'm going to carry them all for the rest of this year. And probably the next year and the following year. <laughs> this one, this is probably going to be the only one I get one of these. But I'm going to get another one of these. Because I want to see if I can get one with have my internet, name, internet handle put on it. Absolutely love them. And this feels like it would be a great utility knife. This is my first Protec, my very first Protec knife. I've always admired their switch blades. I've always wanted to get a Godfather, and you know, I just love their switch blades. They have some wicked looking switch blades. I would love to be able to collect them, but you can't get them sent here to California. You know, this is the only Protec I've ever been able to get sent to me because it's California legal. Both of these are California legal knives. And because they're California legal, you can have them shipped here without having to be law enforcement or something like that. They're shipping the regular people too. <laughs> but if you want, if, if you want to get the bigger ones of these from like a legitimate retailer online, you're going to have to be like active military, active law enforcement, or something like that. Otherwise, they won't send them to you. But these ones, they'll send them to you. The California legal ones. Absolutely love them.
that you guys get a closer look at them. Absolutely love them. I used to always carry the mini lawman and my tough light. Those are like two of my favorite little knives. But these are going to be more fun. <laughs> I have one more little knife coming, but it's going to be bigger than these, though. And it's not a switch blade, but it's a, it's a under three inch blade. And that's a Hogue. And it's the um, micro flip. Because they had the little flipper, and I just wanted to get the little button lock flipper that they have. Because I love the big flippers, the big button locks. I just want to try out one of those. And that'll be the other little knife that I'll be using this year, too. And like I said, when I carry something like this, I'll, I'll carry this and another bigger knife in my pocket. This will be like the back. It's not even really a backup. It's just a, a utility knife. That's why, I, that's why I think of these little knives. I think of them as like being utility knives. Good for opening up boxes, packages, letters. You know, they're, they're, they're fancy letter openers. Let's, let's keep it 100. 100% real. 100% true. You know, if, if I was going to use something for self-defense, I'd want something bigger. But, you know, I'm sure you can use these for self-defense because anything that cuts will cut. You know what I mean? So, but this, this wouldn't be my choice. These are, to me, utility knives. But anyway, that's all I got for you today. Hope y'all doing great out there. Get your shots. Get your shots. Everybody get vaccinated. Peace out. Stiletto.